This is real. This is what? This is a closet. That is a closet. No, so you upgrade. So walk in. Walk in closet. Yes. <laughs> walk in. Yeah, they are not. This is a closet. Try to get the flash. Just talk to me about what is it that you're doing. Well, I mean, I'll look at the closet and flash it out. You know? Try to get it done today. So, um, when did you know you wanted to be a mason? You know, it just come up on me, I mean, I labor up on site, you know, because I've been working on site for years now, when I'm young, you know, and when I mason, buy me one show wheel, buy me one show wheel, right, long time from me, about 20, buy me one show wheel, I said, I've learned to do it, so I just, the day I practice, every day I go work, they give me one liquor, five feet, wall or so. So I go and practice. So till it does come like nothing, I'm going to stick it up serious. Couple of years, well, now. How and long I'm, was that? How long was it? Couple of years, like, how long? Over 10 years. Stick it up serious. So, students are going to school, so I go and go and work them and do your work. And till they get bigger now, actually, I left school, left high school, left college. So I decided to almost start building my place. So all of women work with throughout the years, then come give me some hand for the work. But they help me the block is steel work and all of that. Right. Because they don't really pay them. They just come in and volunteer. I because me bridging them. Right. They love for some of me I do. So I reach to a stage you now where I take care of them. I can do the flashing and the ring. You know? So one of them directly come see me and help me out. But most of the time I do it as I say. I see. Right now, this is just a one bedroom, bathroom, closet. Passage and a veranda. As you can see, me, I do a foundation on a back for next room. Right. You know, because my grandfather and my grandmother they left over there, so give me. Uh -huh. And it's it really bad, in a really bad condition, so I have to just do something. So right now, I just do something. Just do something? Yeah, I just do something because <laughs> we have to help myself. I <laughs> used to go up on site, I used to ask my friend, whoever I work with, say, I wonder when I go up and set up and I want to take in for myself. So every time I come in here, I inspire me to even work more harder because I actually have one for myself and I come from far. You understand? Right. Yeah. So your daughter, right? Even though she's a chef in the making, she assists you at times. You're yes, bringing her in the work as well. Yeah, man. She come in and she help me. Both of them actually are two daughters. I have one day work now. And my community help me too. I can't for my community. Because right now, my community out there, I mix them out. I give them no lift me out, none at all. My neighbor and all of that, they come in and they give me a hand whenever time I work. Because I see money limited. So they ever come in and give me a ball to shop with us, you know, do what we have to do. Right. Yeah. But you, yeah. you seem so excited, you know, doing something that, it's something that you love doing, right? Yes, because remember, you know, everybody can be doctor, you know, and not everybody can be nurse. And teacher, right? So now we have to do some hard work, and it's really inspiring to me. You know, if it's enough female come out and I do more, and I see them for the media, it make me feel good for no say. It come like me, I call them out, <laughs> yeah. So me in a school to tick that me, I see them, and me, I say, yeah, me like it. You know, female can't do anything as long as they put their mind to it, right? Yeah, I just work hard and believe. So, yeah. how, how long have you been working on, on, your, on your own home? Three years. Three years. We still can't move in. <laughs> Such a God. Anybody want to help me? We take help you know, available. We can get some help. I'll take it. Three years now, me I do it. You know, but you know, material expensive and it's expensive for really build overall. So as me go out and me get a liquor money, me just run go buy hardware and me buy a liquor, buy a liquor. You just do it little by little. Liquor by liquor. So how long you think you gonna take your finish it? Well, hopefully. Hopefully by next six months. Because me say it's very expensive. Tired of my door, wind and all these things. So what have you finished so far? Well, me almost finished a rough gas, so I forgot to render it now. And just up the wind on them. I uh, do electrical work, I run the pipe them in, um the electrician come and run all them pipe doing pipe work already. So me have a floor for pipe up basically and flow finish. So you basically did all of this. Yeah, right. I didn't do the block work, so I can't take credit for the block. But yeah, me helping at everything, steel work, all I me just do it. Me tie up steel same way, push them up, cause our video we are, we are doing it. Right. Yeah. So everything I do, I help creep it out, I help dig it out, jack them all of that. 
a young person or someone who want to do something like this what is your what words of advice you'd give to them just go for it go for it because once you have a trade and a skill nothing beat that in life no matter how much you do nothing beat a skilled person right now and building your own place just be save up money in your pocket and if you don't have any money the help you just go out and get help you understand so i encourage anyone who want to do it don't feel shame don't feel embarrassed it's a good trade it's a good quality to have a skill and i try to teach my young daughters and everyone say be a skilled person no matter the level of your education be a skilled person have a skill back of that you know and I learned this, I just pick it up, I didn't go to school for it, but now I'm trying to improve on it. You understand? Because I just pick it up as I go along. Because I have a lot of skilled yeah. persons around me, so I don't try to be just another person around them. I try to, everywhere I go, if I work on an electrician, I try to get something from an electrician. A plumber, I try to get something. A tiler, everything I try to get. Cam to everything. So, it is good. So don't be afraid. You don't have to be doctors, lawyer, and teacher. A skilled person is very good. This is the house that I'm dying to get out of. You can see it is very bad. You know, very, very bad. So I need to get out of it. It's basically falling down on me and my kids them. So right. So I'm trying my best to go as fast as I can on this.